Here is how to do all three of the new hunting event Halloween Easter eggs in Warzone. These first two can only be done on Von Dead. So this is how you do the Witch's Bug Easter egg and it will actually unlock yourself a sick free new blueprint. You need to head over to this tomb within the graveyard and go up to the Witch's Bug to interact with it to activate. But it will glow signaling any players here knowing that you are doing this Easter egg, which is quite annoying. Now this Easter egg is very simple. All you now need to do is make your way over to the windmill to pick up the blueprint, but anyone in the game can pick it up so someone can steal it from you. And I guess that is why why it notifies everyone in the game that it's here. I guess because this easter egg is so easy, this is the way of making it a challenge by allowing people to steal it from you and notifying them that you are doing this easter egg. So yeah, just make your way to the windmill, pick up the blueprint and you will get it. If you are in a team, one person can be in the graveyard, one already waiting there at the windmill to pick it up and they can drop it to allow you to pick it up so that you can get it. And the blueprint does look pretty nice for quite a simple easter egg. Next up, this is how you do the chessboard easter egg on Von Dead. So simply make your way to the chessboard on the map in the southeast and there'll be a missing piece of the chessboard that you then need to find and it'll be located around this area So just look around and you should be able to find it pretty easily Once you've located it You need to look at it until its eyes glow red and then immediately you need to turn around and make sure no one else is looking at it it's A very weird Easter egg so only you can be looking at it No one else in your team no one else in the game if done successfully You need to make a mad sprint over to the spot on the chessboard where it is missing and stand in its location And that will essentially teleport the chessboard piece to its proper location and then you get a bunch of rewards and you will actually get a weapon charm which is checkmate which is actually the horse from the chessboard so yeah this easter egg is a lot more difficult than the other one the final easter egg you can do in any mode battle royale dmz because this one's going to be on almazra you can actually befriend the pharaoh on almazra in the warzone haunting event everyone has been prejudiced and just been immediately attacking him after placing the 10 red skulls on the sarcophagus by killing the zombies in the tomb area of the oasis however if you just don't attack him when he rises from his grave he will actually assist you by rewarding you with a bunch of awesome loot, including a free MRAP that will be dropped down outside of the temple. How nice of him. This is a cool easter egg and that's why you shouldn't judge a book by its cover. He just wanted to help but everyone immediately jumped to thinking he was evil. In fact, he even states he'll reward you. And everyone ignored his cries. You can actually complete the challenge for Operation Nightmare just by summoning him. You don't even need to defeat him. It seems. Just befriend him. The Pharaoh will actually be a boss we see in COD 2024 Zombies as he is reusing attack animations from that game in the files. It's possible the boss may be entirely different, just reskinned, but still have the same animations. I wonder if they will help us in that game too. It would be nice to see an Egyptian Zombies map that's well done, unlike the Archon as well. So that's been all three of the Easter eggs you can do in the Halloween haunting event in Warzone. Let me know if any more I found but I believe this is all of them but yeah if you find anything let me know in the comment section anyways thank you for watching the video make sure to subscribe if you're not here for the latest and greatest call of duty news and information so anyways thank you for watching and uh bye